I see consciousness, the consciousness that I have, that other people have, being very much like a, a conductor on a train driving and that conductor gets in the train and drives off and there are the tracks and, and and I really knew where I was going. Everything was just there in front of me. I would stop, start, go backwards, go forwards. It was just so clear. And the, the journey that I've been on made me realize I was driving this train, but suddenly there were tracks going off to the left, tracks going off to the right, and I could decide whether to go left or right. And when I did that, suddenly the track that I thought I was on was different, the scenery was different. Um, it, everything, nothing was as I remembered, um, so there's a lot of times very scary, uh, I could get very ungrounded, sort of living life thinking completely differently. Um, and then at another point I realized that there weren't really tracks at all, that the way that I think and the way that I um, have been living is in some way, um, what I would use is programmed, uh, that I was taught from the youngest age, and I think we all are in many respects, that um, this is good, this is bad, do this, don't do this, and, and in many respects that, that works to, to a level in terms of it, it keeps things moving somehow, but the moment, say for myself, my body wasn't working, whatever I was thinking and however I was reacting to my environment wasn't working anymore, and I'm I'm not, well I'm clearer now from a spiritual perspective what that was about, um, but for, for a number of us things suddenly just become unclear or confusing or um, the tracks just disappear and we don't know what to do. So the, the, the work that I've done, the breath work, um, the body psychotherapy, even Pilates, it's all about learning to Firstly, control, like what do I have control of, what do I not have control of, those two are very important aspects. And then secondly, um, surrender, what can I let go of that I don't need to, to hold on to, and I think that was a big thing for me um, in psychotherapy. I have what's called a character defense, that's a part of me that interacts with the world, almost like a mask, I guess, but, a, but one that I didn't know I had, but what that was about was that I would decide when someone said something, I knew what they meant, I understood um, what I was doing, um, I had all the answers, and then I began realizing that I didn't, that what everyone was saying to me, I was interpreting, um, and I was only interpreting based on what I had been told, and suddenly all this work that I was doing, particularly the breath work, um, uh, I entered what I call a, a blackness, and I am or darkness, and that's not a negative thing, it's more like going out into the night and not being able to see everything that I knew was um, had changed, or uh, I was required to activate different senses, different abilities in this darkness, and suddenly everything changes. Not that my life is necessarily any different, I still enjoy the same things, same foods, um, I guess my friend network has changed a little bit, uh, my motivations have definitely changed, but the world just shifts just a few degrees off to one side, um, and colours are brighter or darker, um, I feel clearer around what is mine to be dealing with, what is not, what is someone else's. Um, I became very aware that interactions with people, that we both come with our own, in, in therapy it's called um, transference that when I come and meet you or I come and meet anyone, I come with my own history and depending on how this conversation goes, if I like what you say then we're going to get along very well, if you like what I say then this works, but the moment that we both say something different, does that mean that we don't get along or are we just, do we have different templates that we work from? And to understand that and unwind that uh, has been very helpful, so suddenly everything has the capacity to be very different, I can um, realize when I'm pissed off, when I'm uh, angry about something, we were talking about that this morning, um, that I notice it and then I have a, a moment of time uh, to observe and just work out, okay this is a part of me, which part is it, and that's fine, maybe I'm going to be pissed off today, 
Um, that's okay to, to, to be angry, but just to be clear on why I'm doing it. And does this, if, if, if it's towards someone or something, is it this that I'm actually angry at? Or has something happened in the last week, month, even uh, when I was young that, that may contribute to what is causing me this chaos or confusion at this time? 